Tropical Trouble is what we're up to today, and I guess we will see from this point onward if Ice Temple was kind of a fluke in terms of difficulty, because I did get kind of mad at it, probably. Probably a little bit too mad at it overall, considering this game is supposed to be getting hard. But I still feel like I reserve the right to get mad at these kinds of things, if I so choose, or if they make me mad to just follow that emotion. However... If it was just kind of, if this is the way the game is going to be from here on out, then I guess that was okay. It's just that there wasn't much of an overall curve in the difficulty. There we go. Can I, yeah, okay, I can jump in the water. That's good. Bop, cheap, cheap. Bop, I say. Get on out of here. Nice little uh, Yoshi's Island background we got going here. All these colors mesh really well together. I like this a lot. This sounds very, this kind of music sounds very, I guess... Adventure Islandy, probably like one of those Turbo Graphics Adventure Island games or something, or like Super Adventure Island. Super Adventure Island, the first one was a weird game, kind of dumb too. Overall, these are not very threatening enemies. Mario Two enemies are just overall not real threatening. There's no way this is Adventure Island music. This is obviously some kind of Mario thing. The source of which I am, again, probably unfamiliar with, as I have been most of the music in this game. And it looks like we need to take a butt slide. Let's do it. Yee! Oh, that worked nicely. Like a little Rube Goldberg machine of Mario-ness. I'm going to leave that pal alone for now. Oh, hey, I didn't even see that cheap cheap there. Let's get that. Ow! Tweeter, out of my way. All you do is make life difficult for people. Okay, I didn't mean to pick that up, but uh, why don't we just gently set you down like a feather, because I don't know that that's what we want to do yet. And I despawned a Snippet. Woohoo! Okay, that's all that pal block is for then, obviously, so you get out of here, Ninji. Alright, now that you're back, you need to be dealt with thusly. There we go, nothing... Nothing too great came of that, I don't think. So I had to jump to get the other coins? That's a little bit messed up. I don't know about that. Okay, this is seeming... At the risk of inviting trouble upon myself, this is seeming really easy once again. Like, they just stuck a really crazy hard level in the middle of some moderately easy stuff. Me going crazy with the run. Get out of here, y'all. Why don't you two lovebirds go do something somewhere else. Did I get a one-up just now? There's no way I already got like five. Okay, I got actual, I got an actual amount of coins. Hey, 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 Yoshi Egg, come here, you. I like the, uh, I like the appearance of the background as making a little kind of nest. I didn't notice that before, but that is very cute and clever. Hmm. Yoshi, oh, come on, you big old chicken. Cheap, cheap, I am very upset with you. You ruined a nice little moment there. Okay, I can't pick these up or anything, so... Probably just stuck not being able to deal with certain enemies then. Mm, okay, okay, this is where things are starting to pick up, I see. Woohoo, sniff it, alright. Okay. Hmm, I wonder if I can get... No, I can't even pick up those blocks. Do the... Uh, okay. Well, that was... Even within levels, this game takes a really sharp turn. Like, the first was all... dee dee da nothing's wrong, low stakes, doo dee doo and then all of a sudden you pass that midway flag, and it's like... Grah! And we were just gonna stomp on all cheap cheap. We're gonna be very careful around water from here on out. So, okay, that's not like a block I can spit at people. That's not really fun or useful. Yoshi, you big old chicken. Oh, uh, you're annoying. Although it would be really nice to have a Yoshi around because Yoshi would just generally be useful in some kind of situation right here. Let's take the high road so that we can avoid cheap cheeps of any sort as long as we can. All right. You know what? It goes against my better instinct, but I'm still going to try to go down in this pipe once I get a chance. Yep, can't really do that a whole lot. A pipe is really just, in this game, more of like a delivery service for for enemies. Like, 
Venus fire traps and whatnot. Get over here, mushroom. Yes, thank you. All right. I do like the sandy appearance of the cliffs, though. Those are kind of hard cliffs to use, and seeing them customized like that, I think I'd like to use something like that. Those are really nice. They look infinitely more just pretty and usable now. Bunch of nice recolors around here, actually. This is a very vibrant level. Very pretty. I think I've said that word probably more times. Okay, can I do anything with that? I can't. That's just a thing you can basically eat. I don't really understand the purpose of the berry blocks, I guess. Come here. I dare you, Cheap Cheap. Come here. Let's get it on. Bang a gong, Ninji. Get it on. But yeah, if the berry blocks don't really serve any kind of purpose, like you can't pick them up and throw them, then I don't guess I really understand the point of them. Okay, bye-bye, berry blocks. You... We're at the end of something. We're at the end of something very big. I can smell it in my gourd. Bop! Probably just a star at the top here. This is a short level if that was the case. There is nothing around here. This is a dead end, my friend. Well then, am I am I supposed to like make the star appear by eating like all the berry blocks or something? Let's go back and see if I can't make Yoshi respawn or something. Because now that all of the enemies are pretty much gone. All of the major hassle ones anyway. Uh, let's see what I can get out of Oh, boop, 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 Okay. Enemies, you face the wrath. So will that Yoshi... That Yoshi egg does not respawn. What am I missing? Alright, let's explore down around here, but... Yeah, there's nothing really there. That's an awkward-looking background effect. Okay... Hmm. Daddy gets the feeling that he needs to eat all the berry blocks. It's some kind of kill screen thing and you gotta keep your Yoshi around. Is this the case? I guess we will have to find out the hard way. Hmm. Nothing really down there to explore. Just making sure I'm not missing anything because this is a little bit... Wait a minute. Oh, <laughs> oh my god, I just didn't go over far enough. Okay, no, I should have realized it wasn't going to be as complicated as all that. Well, that was a short level then in that case. Huh, okay, I guess Ice Temple was a fluke. So I remain upset with it. Ice Temple, we are no longer on speaking terms. Get out of here, you. That was, that was shockingly easy. I was expecting... I was expecting a real hassle after all that, uh, after all that ice temple noise. So what is going on? Where can I go now? I can go here or down there, and I'm closer to here. Ah, uh, buck up, Toad. It's okay. It's not as bad as all that. I've already got more than half the stars in the game, so, you know, why don't you huddle up with your lice-infested blanket while I go off and do Mushroom Madness, and you just have yourself a time... Why don't you... Ooh, a multiple direction level. They've been very linear so far, actually, so a choice of direction might be nice, even if it is just superficial, in a way. Okay, yeah. Why don't you get out of here, then, yeah. Let's go left and see what can we can do. Well, a foul lot of nothing, it looks like. Maybe it looks like it curves around or something, because we've got a cloud path here. Get out of here, boy. You bother me. Well, there's a lot of stuff out here that I wish I could get to. But it looks like I'm going to need, like, a Yoshi or something. Maybe I should, uh, maybe I should save some of these guys for, for another, hmm. Why don't you not die yet? And I'll kill you, and then... Okay, so there's just a really weird, wacky, convoluted path around this level, I bet. I bet I should just be killing everything, and I'll end up on top of that. Yep, right there. Okay, so it's not as complicated as it looks, as usual. As per the usual. Let's... Hmm, not a lot of madness really going on so far. This is a pretty... This is a pretty organized level so far, I must say. Okay, what's up with you, Pipe? You wouldn't be out on the fringe for nothing. 
Wait, okay, was I supposed to go this way? Okay, I think I was, yeah. So yeah, it kind of looks... It looks non-linear, it has the appearance of being non-linear, but it is in fact totally linear, which makes me a sad face. Hmm. Oh well. Well then I guess I'll just keep on chugging through this level that's full of Koopa Troopas and Goombas and not a whole lot else. Very easy enemies to avoid when you've got Fire Flower at your disposal. Even the, uh, even the Kicking Koopas are not as dangerous as you would expect, really. This is a very, I guess, standard issue Super Mario World level so far. Nothing really... Okay, that's just a background mushroom. Very ugly and kind of out of place, actually. Okay, maybe not. Maybe not. Okay, I see the aesthetic they're going for here. It's just that the mushroom wedges and the mushroom background... Uh... They don't, they don't jive great, I don't suppose. I really wish I didn't have a fire flower, though. If I had had, like, leaves or something, it might have raised the stakes a little if I had been able to maybe go up to the guy and whack him with my tail instead of hitting him with a fire flower. That would have increased the stakes ever so slightly. And we are only halfway through it. This is probably where the level is going to just make everything I said completely obsolete. Unless this is the... Unless these are really all the enemies that we're facing here. This is a... This is a real concerning dearth of enemy variety. It's really... I really hate to use the word boring. But this is kind of... Really just plain. Very... The word that is sometimes used... I don't, I don't mean to use this derogatorily, but... The word that you sometimes hear is vanilla. Uh in terms of levels like this and uh this is like this is the this is like the epitome of vanilla right here do i want to go through there yet or do i want to keep exploring i can't go there to save my life so whatever let's get on let's get on with it and i understand that super mario brothers x you can't do a whole lot of really intense editing with it not everything is uh woo okay that should have kind of i feel like hit the ledge and really surprised me, but it just kind of slid off into the pit. And we must be reaching the end of the level, because that is... That is the fifth star coin, so... Oh, okay, well that one shaved my head. That was a pretty well-placed one. Good on you, little turtle man. Out of all your, like, 20 million compatriots, you are the first to actually hit me. So, good on ya. Let's keep moving. And that's it! That was really just... Hmm. That was really a T-tiny level. I actually want to do one more. That's that's not... My craving is not satisfied for today. I want to keep on moving and doing something else. That one's still unlocked. How about Mr... How about Mr. Pipey down here? You can't actually, I don't think, die in this hub area, which makes a certain amount of sense. Still... Have I been down here to Teeming Temple? I've not. But given my experience with temples, we might want to save that one. So let's go onward to something else. So... So, so, that's so raven. That dark dungeon is so raven. Literally, black as my soul. Hmm. Well, that is some scary-ass music. Hello, you. And it appears I'm going to have to... You don't actually turn around, do you? Is there any way I can lure you out from your hiding spot, Mr. Swooper? Hmm. I have a feeling I'm really about to get crapped on here, but... <laughs> and it was me crapping myself. How about that? Um... Maybe we should stop here. You know what? Those two levels were easy. But I think I'm going to stop there, dealer. I think I'm going to walk away with my chips. And we will come back next time and do either Teeming Temple or Dark Dungeon. Probably Dark Dungeon, because I'm already sitting right here next to it. But anyway, I'll see you guys next time. There's a lot of Teeming and Darkness coming up. And I'm sure that's going to make everything I said in this episode sound totally stupid.